Was this what you talked about when you said that, hey, Lonzo's always getting off the slow starts his entire time? No, it's not Lonzo always getting off the slow starts. It's just him playing the game. It ain't no slow start. It's all the process. We got 80-something games. We're going for 50. Guess what? We only got 49 more to win. He almost had a triple-double this game. He almost been... had a triple-double. Who cares? It's just good excitement watching him playing. Everybody in the stands. Get the triple-double. Get the triple-double. You know what I'm saying? Son, go get that W so we can be 500, 1-1. One one. What about him scoring six points, six of the Lake last eight or ten points for the Lakers down the stretch? Okay. That's what the Lakers is missing. Somebody who know how to close the game. He makes the right decision to make a layup and the right decision to make a pass. Mm -hmm. He got to close the door. He got to be known for that. And he'll slowly build that and everybody start believing him. Guess what? It's going to be hard to beat the Lakers. Everybody looking for that closer. Mm -hmm. Big Thomas Brown, what's up, baby? You're going to get yours. I'm telling you. I know where it's coming to. I can read it. I'm telling you. Watch. Watch. But this is what yes. you meant last night, that it was only one game, basically. It's only one game. Like this, it's only one game. Now you play again Sunday. Now you got to come to the Staples Center. Because see, what I'm telling them is, you want to win all your home games. Okay, you get 40 of them. Mm -hmm. My thing is, you might lose 5 to 10 if you're on your game. Mm -hmm. Don't lose at home. Mm -hmm. So if you can get 30 wins at the house, that's what you want to concentrate on. You can go outside and get the other 20 at somebody else's house. Now, that's how you get to 50. Luke said that he thought Lonzo was getting a bad rap by people who were, who were saying, oh, he got destroyed last night. He's always going to have a bad rap. You know why? Because I'm talking so bad about him. His Lonzo's so good, you can't touch him. <laughs> but everybody want to quiet me up. Why you worried about me? I'm sitting in the stands while my son is whooping that tail. But see, this is what it is. When you're making this money, which the NBA got to do, it's better to say Lonzo versus another point guard than Phoenix versus the Lakers, because that's just Phoenix and the Lakers. Mm -hmm. But when you start matching him up with all these guards and who, what guard he playing next, everybody want to see what guard going to get the best of him. Tell Patrick Beverly that was his last interview for the year, so don't worry about it.